So these last two videos really have me questioning these breathalyzers. So we're gonna test out three different breathalyzers today. And we're gonna see which one lines up, say, with past experiments. So we're gonna do something similar that I've done before. Truly, it's 5%, just like the White Claws. We've got the original breathalyzer that I've been using the most. It is the Backtrack C8. Up until recently, I feel like it maybe has been overused a little bit. I don't know if it needs to get recalibrated. Then we've got the Backtrack S80. So then my most recent investment, the Backtrack C6. So I guess let's get cracking on these Trulies. So kicking us off today on our Truly experiment, we have got Raspberry Lime. It's 5% alcohol to volume, just like the White Claws were. So at least we've got that constant. I'm expecting some bubble guts again tonight. That's fun. I mean, it's not terrible. These things are not easy to chug though. All right, that's one down. Let's give it 15 minutes, see where we're at. All right, it's been 15 minutes. So we're gonna try all three of these and see where we're at. Now, just as a reminder, when we did the White Claws, I was a .016 after one. All right, the Backtrack C8. Zeros. All right, let's try the S80. Zeros. What is going on? C6, it's got a little keychain to it. Zeros. So I'm a straight zero across the board. This is gonna get interesting really quick. So up next we have Wild Berry. Let's see what's so wild about this berry. Ooh, that actually smells really good. Ooh, that's not bad. If I'm putting this up against the White Claws, so far Truly's winning, taste-wise. You can't chug these things. I don't care who you are. Wild Berry gone. All right, I guess I'll see you in 15. Let's see where we're at. Zeros. Two? Two truly on the zeros? 0.022. So this one's on the board. 0.017. <laughs> so I'm all over the board. Oh, man. Guess we're on to the next. Blueberry and Akai. Is it Akai? 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 I feel like blueberry doesn't really have a smell. No, oh no. Oh God, no. I see how much you girls drink these Trulies. You like the blueberry in a K? Ugh. Oh, sorry, was that me? It was, it was you, it was me. This is gonna be hard to put down. Not a fan. Well, I stomached that one down, so we're gonna give it 15. So it's 1027 and I'm, Still not good at math. Nothing's changed in the past year. Oh, what does that put me at? 10, 37, 40. So bad at math. When I did the White Claws earlier this year, after two, I was at a 0 .023. If we go off of that, the Backtrack S80 is more accurate so far. I haven't heard this song in forever. Still have no idea what they're even talking about. This is like a wacky song, like, there's a guy and he's blue, he's a blue man group, and he's a blue little dude and a blueberry soup. I won't quit my day job for a rap career. He's got a blue house with a blue window. What, what? All the trees are blue. What kind of street are you walking on? You got blue trees? What? I don't know if I even never noticed how ridiculous this song was. <sighs> to be honest, these 15 minutes are brutal. Let's go down the line. 0 0.01, all right. We're on the board with the C8. 0 0.056, the S80's got me, got me way up there. 0 0.043. <laughs> I'm, I'm all over the map with these things. All right, so on to the next, Black Cherry. I am a little nervous about this one because the Black Cherry White Claw was my least favorite of the bunch. The mango was where it was at. I should have found a mango truly. 
Once again, I'm a little indifferent. Wild berries where it's at so far. I would really like to know what a mango truly tastes like. Like that needs to happen. I don't have one, of course. Why would I be that smart? I feel like I'm super burpy, so I can't imagine how y'all feel all the time. Hard pass. That's number four. And boy, do we got a story to tell. So let's give it 15 and see where that story takes us. Also for reference, after four, when I did the White Claws, four was 0 0.049. All right, it's been 15 minutes. 0 0.013. 0 0.071. When did I become a lightweight? What happened? <laughs> oh man. Oh no, don't start this, Carl. No, no, no. 0.052. That one is gradually going up. So we've got three different stories going on right now. So we've tried all four of the four pack. We're gonna have to do some repeats. Back to the raspberry lime, because that one wasn't terrible. Let's give it 15 minutes. 0 0.018. 0 0.096. Oh man. 0 0.065. If you look at this right now, 0 0.018, 0 0.096, and 0 0.065. One's way under, one's way over, and one's right in the middle. We're gonna go until two of the three is hit. As a reference, the last time when I did the White Claws at five, I was at a .069. And right now, the C6 is at a .065. So let's just keep this going. Back to the Wild Berry. See you in 15. Wild berry in the street. Let's see where this deadbeat's at. 0 0.018. This one's goose is cooked. 0 0.116. Let's mark it down. 0 0.081. How about that? So six truly have me at a 0 0.081. Where was I last time? Had me at a 0 0.085. We've got a winner, folks. The C6 seems to be the most accurate. So this guy's getting retired. He done. Or she. He or she. So once again, it took me six hard seltzers to hit 0.08. Casenza, I'm calling you out. Where are you at, bro? I'm thinking some beatboxes, maybe some buzz balls. I don't know. You can choose. Let's get weird. Mike Casenza calling you out bro it's been way too long you've been blowing me off so i think with this experiment i have confirmed that my moonshine is not as bad as it made it out to be i think it's a lot more potent if you like this video and you want to see more like it make sure you hit that subscribe button put in the comments what you want to see as far as other challenges that i'm going to do any kind of questions that you have for future guests like the wackier the better I'll see you next time. Cheers.